Hello, welcome to another video from the, the Thirsty, Thirsty Thrifters. Thrifters. Cheers. Cheers. Hello over there. My name is Tara. I'm Dave. And we are part-time resellers on Poshmark. And I forget what else we say here. You have a, uh, your Poshmark closet. My store closet. name. It's, my closet name is Tara the, Studs. The bottom there. Yep. And... We drink wine during our videos, and oh, we have a new one. This one's much better than the last one. This is from Holt Camp Winery. It's in Indiana. It's what town near, was that in? I don't remember exactly, but it, the the winery's like super remote and and um, uh, really inviting. Really, if we had more time, we would have uh, probably Dave. stayed. And uh, is there like a little lake back there, a little pond? This is like really nice setting. Uh, all their all their dry wines were really good. Um, we made a new friend. We can't remember her name. I don't think she told us her name. Yeah, she was the one uh, giving us the samples, and she said she was gonna subscribe to our uh, YouTube. If you did, if and you're you did, watching, comment tell below us your and let name. us know your name. We had a good time. It was very nice to meet you. Uh, the the wine tonight's Arborea. Is that how you say it? I think so. I think it's Arborea. It's like a dry white wine, but it's got, it's it's really kind of got a, a tart grapefruit kind of Yeah, that taste was tonight. in the description, grapefruit. Yeah, I, I like it a lot. So what we're going to do tonight is a haul video. Um, this has been an accumulation because we've barely done any thrifting. We go, we'll go into a store when we're out and about and just get a few things sometimes. So this is like two weeks worth of what we bought. There's a few things we bought for ourselves that are not in here, but this is stuff to sell, most of it. And I thought that I was gonna say something else. Oh, we put that farther away so you can see more of the items. Yeah. But now we have to yell. So hopefully you can hear us. Um, Dave probably doesn't know in, or most of the stuff in this Dave haul. Dave doesn't know anything. Dave doesn't ever know anything. <laughs> <laughs> he wasn't present when I bought a lot of these things. Um, there's okay. some things in this haul that I have found for the very first time. And it's funny because one video I want to do is my thrifting bucket list. Things that I've never found that I really would like to. And I had started thinking of things, started writing things down. And then I actually found a couple. So you're going to see them in this haul. Things I found that I never thought I would. They were on a wish list. So I'll let you know when those come about. Dave's just going to marvel at the wine. Holt Camp was top notch. That's a good winery. Yep. This is our second video of the night, by the way, which is why Dave is happy. Second glass. The first video, I didn't really, I wasn't digging the Chardonnay. Anyway, let's start okay here really? we go yeah but this was one of the Looks brands like she got one shoe i there's another oh, here's one. the other one here's the other one i walked by these twice i knew they looked cool i figured they were like old navy what are they so i didn't even look at them until the very end of my trip what are they see I, if you can read it it's not hard to read i can't read <laughs> not it's not much of a reader stew stew bed, stew so I these are men's bed Oh, Boots. these are men's? These are, they're not your size. Oh, Ryan would wear these for sure. He would rock these. I, oh, let's see if I can see the size. 10. They're US size 10. They've got They two are holes. a little worn. You know, see the heel. But I've never found bed stew. And they were, um, I believe, $4.50 with my discounts. These are rock and roll. That was a good day. I'll show you another thing. I, had, I almost wrote down, I've never found Tory Burch anything. Like shoes are what most people look for. So I went in this little tiny thrift store in my town and was looking through their sunglasses, which is basically free glasses you get giveaways <laughs> or festivals. like 3D glasses you get at the movie theater. And I find Tory Burch sunglasses, <laughs> 50 cents, which was nuts to me. So yeah, I got that. That's like the only thing I got that day. And let's go on to so not something I was really wanting to find. It was a dollar. It was a dollar. 
Talbots, Talbots. size 14 floral plant print plant print they're just like ankle pants i'll save them for the spring they're more springtime thing ankle pants huh? but they were four, size 14 and a dollar i'll take that all right. let's see i went today oh this is just for me because my new thing is to wear very soft skirts and t-shirts it's a new thing like this summer i haven't done that very often oh, I've, I've worn, i didn't say you've been doing it for a while so these this is just blue larue and it's probably gonna be too big on me but i like things that are too big on my waist because i have a sensitive waist area but tara's very sensitive she's very sensitive thank you dave <laughs> That's just for me. Boring. These are... Okay, this was in what town? What town are we in? Batesville. Sam Edelman? Yes. The Batesville Goodwill is owned by a different entity so, than the Central Indiana Goodwill, so they had different pricing. So they wrote on the bottom the price of all the shoes. Like, excellent. they had boots that were like $10 that were from, like, Walmart. Yeah, not happening. But these are Sam Edelman beaded... And they're in good condition for four dollars yeah the pricing was weird like i even had to go ask we had to ask the price what the price was on a couple of things i've never had to do that before at a goodwill but hey it was cool that there was even a goodwill in that town yeah was, we didn't think there was it was a small town this is why we were camping last weekend we we're always looking we were for not thrift expecting. stores so i also got just today nice. brooks pure flow running shoes size nine or i would keep them when i was when I used to run, I wore the Brooks Pure Cadence, so I knew how much they were. These are like great condition. When I used to run, it was from the cops. <laughs> oh, gosh. Just kidding. Man, I These would probably sell for like $40 or so. They cost me five. You didn't run from the cops, no, you surrendered. No, I'm a, I'm a horrible <laughs> criminal. I just, hey, it's me. The guy you're looking for. These are Prana. Yeah. Size 10. I think we got these in Connersville last weekend on the way to camping in the RV. They're like those convertible kind that zip off. My dad had a convertible. This is not story time with Dave. Let's just keep on saying. <laughs> <laughs> that had nothing to do. I thought you were going to say your dad used to wear convertible pants. No. No, nothing no, to do No, he used to wear the bike coat shorts. If you wear these, the buttons. tell me... Tell me why. Like, really? I understand you take them off to... Polyester. I understand you take them off, like, if your legs get hot or if you're wading in the water or something. But what do you do with them? My shins are super hot. I'm taking... <laughs> Dave has hot shins. Uh, hot shin syndrome. Uh, I think honest. I got this at the same place. This is Athleta, uh, like, puffer vest. Puffer. Size extra, extra small. I don't and understand vests. We we established that the last video. Still don't understand them. Maybe just your chest is cold. <laughs> Never had that problem. I'm, I'm anyway, thick up top. I like Athleta, so I buy Athleta. What is this next? This is a jacket. I understand jackets. They have sleeves. <laughs> Ooh, this is a sharp... This one I think I may have messed up on. I thought this oh. I could send to Thread Up Lux, but maybe not. Armani Exchange. Armani Exchange. And it's an extra small. If I can't, I'll show it to my daughter and see if she would wear it. Um, I bet she, I, 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 maybe my sister-in-law. Yeah. They're the only small people I know. <laughs> 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 but Armani Exchange is very nice. I think I got that at Connorsville, too. And we have another Prana, size 6 this time. Same store, Connorsville, Indiana. Thanks, where, where I was very grateful that I lived in Newcastle, Indiana. It was just a little bit worse. Sorry. <laughs> we have more same. convertible pants. Convertibles. If you get hot on your calves. I don't know. Dad had a 70 Barracuda. <laughs> I love that car. Are you serious? Did he actually have a... 70, yeah. Okay. Barracuda. I need to try these on. I forgot. Who's the manufacturer? Here's the question oh, of the day. Gosh. Who's the manufacturer of the Barracuda? Comment below. I have no idea. I don't do cars. 
I Dave know. will not be able to figure out this brand. I could barely figure out this brand. Thanks for the confidence. No, it's I, somewhere in it. I think I had to look at the little tiny tag. But there's no size. There, let me just tell you. You're this looking is the only up the time skirt. It's acceptable to look up a skirt. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I wanted I to know. try them on because I might be able to wear them. They're Royal Robins, which is another outdoor oh. brand like Prana or. Yeah, but Royal Robins, like, isn't that a really good one? It sells. It's similar to Prana, similar to North Face, all those. But if it fits me, I will adopt it in my skirt, t shirt lifestyle. Super. Okay, I also got this today, and I have to look up to see if it's anything. My niece is adopted. Oh, I don't think she knew. Wait, yeah, she's from China. Oh, my gosh. <coughs> Your family is very white. She knew. Yeah, she knew. Okay, I she saw knew this. She something was up. Go ahead. I saw this today, and I saw this. Mouse. It's like, oh, this must be Disney. It's Kingdom Couture by Disney Parks. Another vest or tank top, whatever. Beaded. Yeah. So Holy a lot of Disney Park God. stuff is very expensive, but I don't know if this is something desirable. It's lace, it's beads, crochet. So I'm going to look it up. What more could you want? Because if it's not worth anything, I can return it. Lace, beads, crochet. That marks off That's all, all my... That's all Dave wears. <laughs> that marks off all my... <laughs> My list. Oh yeah, it's my turn. Oh, the cats joined us. Come oh, here, Lord. Just uh, go ahead and uh. This is Cece. She's my cat. She loves me. She belongs to all of us, actually. She sits on my desk all day long because she loves me. Go ahead. And okay, she... here we go. See if you can figure out what this is. <laughs> teeny teeny like, tag. Oh, it's uh free people. Yeah. I've seen that tag before. Free people, size six pants, like jogger style almost. Yes. It's a cuff. It's not an elastic. But hmm. I'll look it up. If it's not worth anything, I can return. Free people print, is huh? hit or miss lately. Interesting print. Pretty much all misses lately. I don't know. Uh -oh. This is probably for me, but I can't figure out the size. Champion C9 bra. They're my favorite workout bras. Oh, crap. Okay, so if you have ever... Oh, crap. There's like these bars in some tops and sports bras. Can you see that bar? And the number of I bars... Can't see the bar. Can you see it right there? That's one bar. The number of bars can tell you what size it is. So size one. No. <laughs> Usually one bar... I just looked this up. I believe one bar in like a Lululemon and such is a size four. Probably in this brand, it's a small because they don't come in numbered sizes. It's small, medium, large. And I do not do smalls, so that may go to my children. But I do need new sports bras all the Your time. Your children? I don't think Edison is going to want that. We have two girls. Oh, yeah. yeah. Gosh. We have two girls. But, yeah, smalls are not going to... My sensitive uh, <laughs> waist area cannot... Just my sensitives. Sensitive, my sensitives my sensitive mid body area can't take that much uh is that what we're calling gosh. these days my sensitives my waistband my bra band my chest my sensitives. you all know what i'm talking about it's, the old sensitives are gosh go pick up another item well this is for sensitives oh yeah see these have the same things in them they sorry i'm just taking over go for it they oh. have, do you see these? My sensitive One, two, don't three, four, need five. Those. So this is Calia, the Carrie <laughs> Underwood brand. Can you see that? Carrie's making bras too, huh? I have two of these. These are purchased in Connersville. And that's one a, it's got three bars or four. That's five. Five. Let's learn to count. I can't read it. Do it, Dave. One, one, two, three, two. four. Oh, what's the next one? I think four, six, eight. I think this is a size twelve. She was counting by twos. Because that's how they do it. And then the other one has one less bar, so that's probably a size 10. They're the exact same bra. You can pick up the other one. They're oh. exactly the same, but they're different sizes. And they were right next Whoa, to each other. this one's got a symbol. This one does too. This one's only got four bars. Yep. I feel like we're talking about phone service. 
How many bars do you have? So I think this is a 12 and that's a 10 maybe. It smells kind of good. If you know better about Calia sizing with the bars, let me know. But um, Bars on bras. Probably one of those I'll keep for myself because those sizes are okay on my <laughs> sensitives. <laughs> bars on bras, not bras on bars. Okay, let's move on. Another Connor's little purchase, I think. What More other sensitives. town did we go to? We went to oh, we went to Richmond too. Richmond, Indiana. I think this was Richmond. Okay. We have a timeshare in Richmond. No, we do not. <laughs> this is Coco Ship brand, which I've never heard of, but it's like a swim dress halter. And you see that print? It's like little anchors. Cute. I'll put that away until February. That's when I'm gonna list swimwear. Good call. Dave isn't <clears throat> picking up the cues about it's my his turn. turn. Oh, Calia. Yep. More Calia. This shorts. was in Batesville, where we had to ask how much things were, and the shorts were three fifty. Size, size large. Size large. So that's a good choice. We'll list that in the spring. Probably around February. Maybe. Um, lost where I am. Okay, this was also in. Why'd you give me so much stuff? Richmond. I have another pile. Oh, okay. Uh, this is. High Drive, no, High Dive. This is bad cursive. High Dive by Mod Cloth. So, high waisted bottoms. Sharks. And this is a Shark Week type suit, isn't it? Shark Week has a totally different thing for women. It means a different thing for women. And. Oh, my bad. Yeah, I didn't know that. Look at the back zipper. Our other cat is sitting here just watching like she's. Nobody cares a, about the cat. YouTube subscriber. No it's one, size medium. Some people do care. If you care about the cats, please <laughs> comment below. Because I think some of you do care about the cats. Can I you think move you on? Do. Yeah. I think they do care about the cats, though, Tara. They don't. That's not they very know nice the cats thing. are fine. That's all she they She said that about. in front of the cats. They don't speak English. They do speak English. All right. Uh, smart wool. Yeah, smart wool. You don't know what smart wool is. No. I found smart wool accidentally in like my first month of reselling. Is that the name of the brand? Yes. <laughs> I bought it. like a smart is this wool. Is this underwear? Yeah, I bought a smart wool tank top and it sold like the day I listed it or something. And I was like, oh, is this something? So I saw these smart wool men's long underwear that Dave didn't even show anybody. He just. I showed them. They're long underwear. Black. What, what else do you what need? What size? To... Mm. They were one dollar. They were half off that time. Large. I... There we go. In case you want some smart wool long underwear with the man pouch. They've got a place for you to pee out at the front of them. <laughs> okay. I have well, a little. As, as all underwear should. For women. No. Exactly. Yeah. That's how you know it's a men's if it has the the pouch. It's, it's not a men's. It's not a pouch. That's what I'm calling it. It's not a pouch. It's an it's an opening. It's like a it's garage a door. I'm it's called gonna, a garage. It's more of a garage in. door. It cradles like it a pouch. It cradles. <laughs> I don't want to see your hands do that ever again. It cradles. No. It's it's a garage door. <laughs> <laughs> you part it. MP. Okay. Lululemon, cool racerback tank. I looked up the style. I think it's like Midnight Lily or something. Midnight Lily. You see that pattern? I have to measure the size, but it's about my size, so it's probably an 8 or 10. Anyway, Athleta. Athleta. This was at the store where we had to ask how much crap was. It was four fifty, I think. Uh, yeah, they're like capri length and they have mesh pockets and I don't remember what size and Dave's not going to tell you. <laughs> Small. <laughs> also, if you need to know, it was made in Vietnam. <laughs> Can I have some more wine? It has a zipper in the back that works. A lot of them Ooh, do. I'm not supposed to mess with the zippers. Yeah, don't touch zippers. I break zippers. This, um. For fun was just a random thing I thought Dave might want and then it didn't fit him. It's a chick so, hat. 
No, there's no dude how's, that has a head that small. How? I bet there is. How's my attitude? Call one eight zero eight eat dirt. And I know this is. Uh, I watched an episode of Mike Rowe, and what they do is they wash everything in um, the dirt. In, in it's in a place in Hawaii, and the dirt's all red, and it, that's how they dye all their shirts and their hats. So. I looked it up and they are worth something. They sell for like 15 bucks or so, but this one does have a spot here. It was washed in dirt. No one cares. And a spot under there, but yeah. we'll see. It might sell. Red Dirt is the brand. They, it, it was a really interesting, uh, show. show. Yeah. Mike I'm Rowe. intrigued. Dirty Jobs. I love Mike Rowe. Dirty He's Jobs. He's hilarious. I don't know. <laughs> You love Mike Rowe. This yes. is news to me. We're in a relationship. <laughs> That's funny. Because <laughs> I thought we were in a relationship. You thought. <laughs> you heard it first. Hey. Doing this, it too. This angle and this bra and this shirt is not flattering. I'm not going to do this again. Okay. Sorry. What's this one called? One September. Yeah. This is an anthropology brand. I had a feeling. And I did try it on and it was it's a little sheer in the back. A little too flowy and such. Flowy and sheer. Did your mom buy this? I bought it. We bought it in Batesville. What size is it? it I, I keep forgetting the size thing. Because uh, if you small. want any of this stuff, you can email us. We need to start putting our email in there. Yeah. And sell it for cheap. Like yeah, but we still need to make a smidge of profit. We did we did search these treasures Not too out. Much. Not we too found much. them in the universe and plucked them out so the Whoa. people could You did most of the plucking. I know. I'm a plucker. <laughs> you you Mother pluck, plucker. You are a mother plucker. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to remember the where I got mother it. plucker. <laughs> <laughs> I got this at the attic window in Muncie, Indiana. Oh, we have Torrid, a time share in Muncie size too. Three. I don't remember why I went up there. I was bored one day, I think. So it's a very soft green sweater with some little crochet. This is not crochet, it's knit. I did used to knit. So I know the stitches needed to make these. So it's not crochet, it's a knit. And there's ribbing and I could make this if you gave me like 40 hours and a, a week off. Yeah, it's 40 hours. Or I could just buy it for three dollars yeah let's do that okay so this this was the first thing well i found this brand in purses but never in clothing saturday size medium i remember there's, the size there's the thing above saturday read the thing above saturday or below or kate spade aha uh -huh. that makes a difference i it think it does I do need to sweater shave it a little bit, and it's just a soft striped t-shirt basically, but I'll look it up to see how much it's worth. I might even try it on. It's got to look better than this droopy Kermit. Droopy Kermit. Here, do that one because the last two are mine. Oh. Oh wait, there's, there's a Express. four more. The Portofino shirt. Yeah. So. Yeah. I bought these. Whoa. Portofino shirts because of Rosa. I'm blanking on names right now. This is busy. She has a YouTube channel. Um, I've sold a couple of my Portofino shirts. I think I saw two or three left. Size SP. No, it just says small. S slash P. S with a line and then a P because in... So, what's the word small in Spanish? Uh... We could be here all day. It's Pequeño. I was going to say that. So it's not small petite. It's saying Pequeño. P is the Spanish abbreviation. Cool. Okay. This is something I had never found. And I found it in my local Goodwill. So it's not on my list anymore. Oh, is this a bucket lister? It is. Can you tell what these are? Those are pockets. <laughs> I know. These are dojos. I had heard about dojo jeans. 
from the, like the minute I started reselling, which was in May of 2018. So how many months are we on now? A year and three months? It's a bunch. I have found them once. I, I'm going to use quotes, finger quotes here. Air quotes? Finger quotes. Air quotes. I'm using my fingers, not the air. Yeah, it's air quotes. And I found them at a thrift store here and somebody had cut them off like to make them capris so they were no longer flares and then they had taken in the waist like such not on these though so they were not i don't even count them but these are size 27 no fraying on the bottom legit they were on my list and now they're not on my list boom couldn't believe it took me that long to find one pair of dojos. Throwing a bra at me. That's right. not my bra. It's oh. nowhere near my size. What? Nowhere near my size. <laughs> me either. This is a little This big. is letters of the alphabet that I'm not familiar with. That's it's time. a Soma bra. It was like half off. Soma. 36G. Yeah. Gargantuan. I don't, you're offending people now. Oh, I'm sorry. That's. I mean, I thought it was a good thing to have big. Like that's to the level where you're having back problems probably. Oh, well, I don't mean to offend anyone. And on the Poshmark app, the, the cup sizes, once you get past a certain point are, they're weird. Like they put double D as E or something, but everybody in the world calls it double D, not E. I don't remember. It's it's very odd. I still have two more things and I thought I only had one. I'm sorry. So this was another thing I had never found before. Never thought I'd find it in my town. I found all birds. Can you see that? All birds? These are Good. running shoes all birds made of wool. Whoa. So they do have um, some discolorations and staining. I don't know if you can see that. I have washed them already. You can wash all birds in cold water and air dry them, which I've done. Wow. They're men's 11. These are pretty nice. Wool runners, not Dave's size. Yeah, I know. I just noticed they're super light. Probably list them for 40 or 50 or so. I can't believe how light they are. But they were at my local Goodwill. The last thing, this is already sold. Oh my gosh, there must have been a cat that laid on it. So I'm going to have to. You think? This is my personal thing that I always buy full price because it, I know it will sell fast. It was that cat. <laughs> Probably that cat. Uh, these are my personal favorite jeans. I know when I like them on, fa on Facebook. <laughs> you were going you were gonna to call me out on that. Hey. I've just never seen you like them on Facebook before. I just was going to ask. Really on Facebook? When I like them on Poshmark, they're always sold very fast. There are things I'll like on Poshmark that will not sell for months. But these jeans sell like fast every time. Have they sold yet? These have sold. These sold in a day. <laughs> I've only found two pairs uh, besides for myself for ever. And they both sold in one day. So if... They're not a huge money maker, so well, the our cats, cats are fighting. fine. Keep that in mind. They're not a huge money maker, but they sell so fast that I will always pay full price for them. So they're democracy. Oh my gosh! <laughs> full fledged going at it. Democracy ab solution jeans. The bigger the size, the better, as usual. These are the skinny. That's what she said. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Yeah. These are skinny. That's what I always buy. The skinny. They have boot cut and such, but I always buy skinny. They have the same pockets on the back. They have this wide waistband elastic. That's why I buy them because they do not hurt my sensitive waistline. I don't know if you know this, but sen she's sensitive. I could go into more personal details, but I don't think Dave wants me to. She's so sensitive. Okay, anyway, these are size 12. I listed them yesterday. They're sold already. So I got to uh, lint roll these because my cat slept on them and then ship them out tomorrow. That's the end of the haul. 
All done. How in the world did it take 30 minutes to do that? Because you talked about convertibles. It's a 70 Barracuda. It was red. Beautiful car. I can remember taking rides in it when I was a kid. Falling asleep in the back seat. It was a bench. Bucket seats in the front, of course. Let me know when you're done. I'm done. Okay. So that's pretty much everything I bought in two weeks because we've been RVing, camping, hiking, listing, hiking, doing stuff. Going I like through to spider do. webs. Oh my gosh. The last the last place we went, the hikes. I had a, a I got a stick at the beginning of every hike to hold out in front of me as we walked because I was walking through so many spider webs. I got one spider or bug on me, didn't I? Yeah, she freaked all the way out. Screamed. I I really really don't like spiders or bugs. I don't <clears throat> I don't freak out. I do a very vigorous dance to get the bug off me. Yeah, she freaks out. No, I just stop what I'm doing in it and do everything I can to get the bug off me. If it's on my Which back, anybody around would be calling freaking out. Except for you. It's very calmly freaking out. It's not calm. It's dancing. It's not dancing. It's enthusiasm. It's, it's enthusiastic. <laughs> I really, really, really don't like bugs or slugs or snakes. And she married So I me. hike. Are you saying you're a slug and a snake? Sluggy snake. That was my <laughs> nickname in high school. Sluggy snake. No. All right. So, hey, are we done? <laughs> <laughs> we can be done. All right. Kermie says we're done. <laughs> Kermie. All right, Kermie, hit the button. <laughs> I have to. I have to get up for this. Cheers. Cheers Kermie. to Kermie. Good night.